Hi everyone, this is Rob Powell from robpowellbizblog.com and in this video you'll discover how to create a personality quiz that engages with your visitors and builds your list fast. I'll show you why personality quizzes have such high conversion rates, how you can use them to segment your list, why they go viral and how to build one in seven simple steps. But first, make sure to subscribe to my channel that way, when I release new videos, you'll get notified. Let's look at the three main reasons personality quizzes work so well as lead magnets. Firstly, people want to learn about themselves. We're all on a lifelong quest to find out what makes us tick. And that's what personality quizzes do. They reveal to the quiz taker something about themselves. A quiz gives people insights into how they are uniquely wired. They can then use that information to choose a solution that best fits them. Secondly, quizzes create interaction and engagement. Personality quizzes allow your visitors to interact with your website. Attention spans on the internet are getting shorter and shorter. Anything that's interactive will keep users involved with your website for longer. That's going to increase your dwell time, which is good for the SEO of your website. But more than that, Engagement is a key to establishing a relationship with your visitors, so anything that makes your visitors interact with your website is going to help build a relationship between you and your visitors. Thirdly, quizzes give customized results. Personality quizzes overcome the one-size-fits-all experience that most websites offer. With a personality quiz, your visitor is going to learn something unique about themselves and that's what makes them engage with your quiz and complete the sign-up process. Personality quizzes also allow you to segment your list. The people who sign up to your email list don't all have the same needs and interests. Let's say your website is about running an online business. Someone who's owned a website for over five years and has 250 published articles and an email list of 30,000 won't be interested in tips for beginners on how to set up WordPress. In a personality quiz, you can ask questions that will allow you to separate these two types of visitors into separate results or outcomes. You can then map the quiz outcomes directly onto groups that you create within your email marketing service. You now have a segmented list that allows you to send the right content to the right segments within your list. Finally, Personality quizzes can go viral. According to research by BuzzSumo, the average quiz gets shared on social media 1,900 times. People just love sharing their quiz results on Facebook, and that's going to bring you tons of new traffic you otherwise wouldn't have got. So let's look now at the building blocks of an effective personality quiz. A lead generation quiz consists of four main elements. The questions, the answers, a lead capture form, and the results. Once the respondent has finished answering the questions, a lead capture form appears, asking them for an email address where you can send the results. As soon as they enter their email address, the answer to the quiz is revealed. The key to making a personality quiz is to start from the end and work backwards. That's because the questions you ask will be determined by the quiz results or outcomes. This may sound strange, but it'll become clear as we go through the process. So let's begin designing a personality quiz, starting with the results. Most personality quizzes have three to five results, so aim for something in that range. More than five results and you're setting yourself up for a lot of work. Try to make the results somehow connected with the topic of your website. For example, in a personality quiz for a coffee website, your results might look like this. 1. You're a breezy light roast. 2. You're a tasty medium roast. 3. You're a refined dark roast. and 4. You're a sultry espresso. On a website about entrepreneurship, your quiz results might look like this. One. You're a determined go-getter. Two, you're an enthusiastic influencer. Three, you're a supportive mediator. And four, you're a meticulous analyst. Now let's look at the questions. 
Your questions and answers need to lead to one or other of the different results, and that's why we started with the results first. Try to ask questions that reveal something about someone's personality. For example, you could ask, which famous person do you admire most? The answers could include Nelson Mandela, Oprah Winfrey, and Steve Jobs. You can infer from those answers something about the quiz taker's personality. Or you could ask, what is your greatest achievement? The possible answers could be A, having great friends, B, traveling a lot, C, advancing my career, D, starting a family. Again, the answer to the question will tell you something about the respondent's personality. Here are some more examples of quiz questions that will reveal something about your quiz taker's personality. 1. If you could have anything you want, what would it be? 2. If you could get rid of one limiting belief, what would it be? 3. Where do you want to be in five years' time? 4. How do you feel about change? 5. What do you think is holding you back from reaching your goals? And 6. How do you handle challenges? Try to include 5 to 10 questions. Less than 5 questions and your quiz will seem a bit thin, but more than 10 questions and people will likely get tired and give up. Create 3 to 5 possible answers for each question. More than that, and it becomes difficult for the respondent to choose the right answer. Make the answers as different as possible from each other. This makes it easier for people to choose an answer. Also, having radically different answers helps the quiz taker get a perspective on themselves. So now, let's go through the process of building a personality quiz in the Interact Quiz Maker. Interact has a free version that you can access through the link in the description below. Before starting, make sure you have assembled your questions, your answers and your results. Step 1. Open a blank quiz template. Log in to your Interact Quiz Builder account and click Create New Quiz. On the next screen, choose Start from Scratch. And on the following screen, choose Personality Quiz. Step 2. Add your quiz title and cover image. On the Interact Quiz Builder, you can navigate to the different elements for your quiz using the menu on the left side of the screen. Click on the cover element and give your quiz a title and upload a cover image. Step 3. Add your questions and answers. Paste your questions and answers into the blank fields, like this. If you have more than two questions, click the Add Answer button. Step 4. Add the quiz results. Be aware that the more positive your results sound, the more likely it is that people will share their quiz results on social media. Make sure to add an image that sums up the result. And if you can make it humorous, so much the better. You can also add a call to action. This might be a link to a relevant article on your website, or it could be a link to a product or service that is related to the result your quiz taker got. Step 5. Organize the quiz logic. This involves matching answers to results. Go back to your questions and click on the Edit Result Correlations button. This is where you will associate each answer with one or other of the results. To associate an answer with a result, click on the answer and then click on the result that you want to match it to. You don't have to match every answer to a result, and you can match more than one answer to a single result. The correlation works like this. Every line going from an answer to a result adds a value of plus one to that result. Step six, add an opt-in form to your quiz. Next, turn on lead generation in the left side menu. You'll then need to do three things. One, connect your Interact account with an email provider, such as Aweber, MailerLite, MailChimp, ConvertKit, etc. 
Two, set up your opt-in form. And three, map your results to groups within your email provider. The last step, though, is optional. Step seven, publish your quiz. Now, just hit publish in the top right corner. You'll then see various options for taking your quiz live, including share link, embed code, pop-up, and Facebook ad. And that's it. You've now created a high converting lead magnet that should help grow your list fast. I hope this video was useful. If so, please like and share, and I'll see you next time.